everyone welcome back to the vlog I'm doing so well I am so impressed with myself slash just happy um that I'm doing it I'm doing the damn thing so it looks like to you like I'm quite bundled and that would be correct so this is the this is the thing it's cold out in New York now um like 40s and I but I love being cold so I have my windows open um and I don't mind just bundling up it's just like a nice little extra layer it's cozy but the air is cool so it's my perfect combination I really enjoy being chilly I like bundling but I run really warm so it has to be cold for me to bundle because otherwise I'm just sweating it's either this or I'm sweating you know the scale is like that so welcome back to the vlog it is another week I have just less than two weeks left it is October I cannot keep up on the dates it is October 19th um, which happens to be my sister's wedding anniversary happy anniversary Ellie and Scott if you're watching three years but I am doing more packing so I thought I would whip out my camera and just kind of show you the progress so with this move I wanted to do things differently usually I wait to the very last minute and I just pack everything up and I have like five days and I'm so stressed and I just procrastinated too much but it's been from Brooklyn apartment to Brooklyn apartment so it was sort of easy I could take ubers and like do trips if I wanted like it wasn't this like really intense thing this is a very different move. It's a long distance move. So when the movers come for me at the end of the month, I have to have everything ready and like be able to be loaded onto like a truck that will be eventually dri driven to my new apartment. So I'm just trying to prep a little bit more. And that being said, I'm doing a little bit each night um, and I'll just show you, I'll stop talking and I'll show you what I've done. So this is like one box also. Oh my God. I'm I'm so behind. I literally am only I'm only this far, like a couple chapters. I'm really, really behind. Um, but so no spoilers, but I'm obsessed. So I did this one big box that has just like random stuff. So LOL this says closet contents, some vinyl and bedding. Who is that? What? It's so random. Anyways, um over here I have a lot of my like fragile wine glasses. So LOL, fragile, fragile. Um, I have CDs, what does that say? CDs, cards, cords, miscellaneous, awesome. So I've got four boxes there. I have a ton of boxes here. These are actually like book boxes. So I have like all of my books in these bottom two and then some books, DVDs, stuff like that. Yes, I still have DVDs, don't come for me. I got rid of a lot, but like I am a DVD gal. But my goal this week is to pack up everything that lives inside of like cabinets so this entire TV console is empty which is what I wanted to do I want to empty out all of these cabinets that just have like pots and pans that I don't really use every day so I'm gonna do that so that's all to say that I'm feeling good about it I feel like I'm getting ahead of it it's only Wednesday so I have tonight tomorrow and probably a little bit on Friday depending on what I do um, to pack up and then I really think I'll be in super good shape. But that is the packing update I wanted to share. I feel excited, lots of emotions, but I'll bring you along. Hello, reporting to you live from my Brooklyn apartment. So it's later and I did a little bit. I didn't do as much as I wanted, but this is the thing. I got two more big boxes done and these blankets have to go in like another I have like another box that'll be just blankets oh these are heavy but I really cleaned up behind here so basically lol I have random things but that was a mess and that's all cleaned up so that feels really really good this is a bag of things I'm going to actually just throw out it's like really old like ratty stuff um so i did that but i think that's it for the evening i i just got tired packing is exhausting and i just like this box i did was so random it had like half my vinyl and then like two jackets a sweatshirt and like a heating pad like it doesn't make sense some boxes have so much purpose and like rhyme and reason and then others are just dumb hello everyone it is the next day the next evening actually 
and um, I don't think I filmed much yesterday but I'm packing again and I think I've made a nice dent so I'm gonna show you quickly my updates so basically I emptied all of this except for except for my air fryer and my um, Nutribullet which I use every single day both of them but like this all had like pots and pans I just have a few reusable bags I use for groceries and that's literally my drill that I'm gonna need to like take stuff down. So those are the only two things left there. I had a whole bunch of stuff in here that I only have these bowls left. This is food that'll obviously all just go either be eaten or thrown out. And then this was full as well and I only have a few things left there. And then just like a couple things that I use every day. And then whenever you're doing kitchen stuff, a really good hack is to, or even like breakables, is to use your clothing to like make a buffer so like nothing breaks. So these two boxes have a ton of kitchen stuff at the bottom and then clothes on the top. So I've cleaned out a lot of like my summer stuff I know I won't wear. Um, the rest of the kitchen stuff, I'll just use this as like extra padding. So like that's always a hack I've done. I feel like it works really well. Next is to get all of this stuff in here done. I'm probably going to do this on Sunday. I'm dedicating Sunday as like probably the biggest packing day because next week, Monday through Friday, I'm like booked and busy. I've got things every night. So I'm really going to like do a lot on Sunday. I'm going to do a lot on Sunday, and I feel, like, really excited and good about it. Fun update, we're going to the orchard. We're going to the apple orchard on Saturday. You think we're going to go through my last October in New York and not go to the orchard and just get sh-wasted? No, we're going. Fun times to be had. Um, that'll be a hoot and a holler, and I can't wait for that. Okay, well, that's it. So I'll talk to you guys later, probably tomorrow. Don't know what's going on, but, like, see you then. Bye. Hello everyone. It is the next day, a couple days later. I'm not sure when I vlogged last, but it is Friday, which is always a good thing. It's Friday at 5.47 p.m. Hey Tay, release day today. Incredible album. But um, it is almost six o'clock. I'm getting ready to leave to go over to Kara's. We are doing a girl's night, one of the last girl's nights actually, um, because next Friday is my last Friday and I, it's, I can't. Anyways, we're going over to Kara's. She is going to cook us some comfort soup, like, like a potato sausage leek soup, like my dream. Um, and we're gonna have some garlic bread and some wine. So just a girls night, and I wanted to bring you guys along um, just to show you specifically the food. I feel like it's gonna be really good. Yeah, I gotta get going. Okay, see you in a bit. Hello, miss, ma'am. How's it going? It's going amazing. Show my apartment, have you shown oh, my I have, I have. I think I did it at Vlogmas, but it's, I feel like it's had some, in, not I was gonna say improvement, some um, changes. Addition? Yes. We love the vibe. It's immaculate vibe. She get, gets great light. Yeah, I, I remember filming a brunch here, I think. Yeah. I did. I told them we're having potato, sausage, and leek soup. And here she is chopping up some leeks. Uh oh, get out of the kitchen, Kara. You have a leek. Carrie with the pun. Julia, welcome to the girls' night. Welcome to the girls', girls room Debbie, bike yeah. week welcome. 98. Like Debbie, remember Debbie? I yeah, like what's eggs. this shirt we have though? It's, it's bike week. It's bike week. Vintage. Vintage. It's technically his, but I found it at a vintage store. Actually, no, I paid for it, so it's yours. Oh, okay, great. Hi, Tess Christine. Great shirt. Sure Look at her. She's there by the fern. <laughs> Banana phone. Um, yellow. Yummy! Is this for the bread? Yeah. Okay, soupy zazanis. Incredible. Okay, gonna get my own. Yummy. No. You can't see it, but it's in there. It's, oh my god. Is it good? Kara! Alright, so. <laughs> Just like the millennial girlies we are. <laughs> We're gonna Making film a TikTok. A TikTok. Oh, oh, oh shit. shit. We're good. <laughs> We're good. 
Just got a little ring light, little situation. Is that better? Yeah. Ew. Better. Ew. Ew. Okay, we had two. Wee. Oh, the ring light. Pain in my heart. <laughs> Pain in my heart. How to go, ladies, are round one of the Tiki Talks. Great. 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 You can find it at testchristine.com <laughs> forward slash TikTok. Forward slash TikTok. <laughs> Spencer Pratt likes the song Vigilante Shit. Like, <laughs> of course. <laughs> I got that on my vlog. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. I am running out the door, so I quickly wanted to intro today's festivities. We're going to the orchard. It is semi-early, 8.38 in the morning. I don't know why I keep giving you guys like the exact time. It is Saturday, and I'm going to go get on the train and meet Julia and Chatty, and we are gonna get to Grand Central to hop on to another train to go up to the Apple Orchard. We go to a place called Harvest Moon. It's in North Salem, New York. So um, yeah, we're gonna go. Tess, Pat, Theo, and Tess's parents are meeting us, so we're gonna have a whole little group there, and have an amazing apple orchard day. I'm running a little late, so I have this dress that I got from H&M. It's this kind of like flower prairie dress, and then I just have a sweater over it, and then literally just tennis shoes because I want to be comfortable, and it's, yeah. So that's the outfit, cute. Okay, I'll see you there. Club Harvest Moon. Oh, Hi, Theodore. Hey, you see the dogs. You look at the animals? Yeah. Were you waving to the animals? You see Hi, Yeah. Yeah. Hi, Deanna. Hi, Carrie. Welcome to the Orchard Vlog. I love the Orchard. Woo! What's not to love? What's not to love? Cheers. Cheers. This is my new bestie. All right, we got all this food. Oh, yummy! Oh, Patrick. Hi. I was running errands. I had to get had to get some sippy cups. Ooh! How are you feeling coming to the orchard for our fifth year? I love coming to the orchard. It's probably the highlight of fall. I agree. I, it's I like, agree. It's I don't know. It's orchard days are superior. superior. Superior, superior traditions. Superior traditions. Traditional superiors. Yeah. <laughs> All right. We got Shaddy Shadsters brought with the pizza. There it is. See? Yeah, it's personal size. It's, it's good to share, though. Yum. That looks really delicious. We're on a tractor. What do you think? It's going to pull us. Very exciting. Very exciting. Mom and Dee Dee and Grandpa are all here. Oh my gosh. Yo, is the nice man gonna give you a ride? Oh my gosh! <gasps> he loves trucks. Oh! <laughs> look at him look. He's like, oh my god. He's like, what the hell? <laughs> Hi, Theodore. Put some Nas on it. It is. You Mommy? Do you want to sit by me? Would you like to sit by me? Hey. Oh, he likes Auntie Ju. He likes Julia. Tess is like, what the hell? Beep, 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 beep. Wide load, wide load, <laughs> wide load. <laughs> okay, bye bye, oh, Grand I'm Central. Bye <laughs> bye. Beautiful station. Oh. Hello everyone. Oh, there's a box there. <laughs> Packing day, 2022. Welcome. You're on a tripod and I'm loving this little um, setup for us. So basically today is um, Sunday, October 23rd. I am gonna do the main packing today because I really just, it's a gloomy day, I have nothing to do, it's Sunday, and I've mentioned this earlier in this vlog, I think that I'm booked and busy all week. I got plans Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And then I don't want everything to be left next Sunday. So you're getting what I'm saying. You're smelling what I'm stepping in. And is that the phrase? You, I'm smelling what, I'm, what you're stepping in? Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, let's pack. 
let's do it. Let's do the damn thing. I just made a smoothie. Mmm. Delicious. Healthy. Inside, I have spinach, which I make spinach ice cubes. Let me take these mother effing things off. Like, who am I? <laughs> so basically, I will buy fresh spinach, and I will just put a little bit of water, and I'll blend it up so it's like a whole liquid jar of basically just like spinach juice don't add anything else just a little bit of water and i freeze those into ice cubes and it is the most genius if you are a smoothie person and you want you put greens in your smoothie and you want them to stay fresh but not lose nutrients literally saw this on a tiktok months ago and it's changed my life first of all it's already ice so it helps you make your smoothie really smooth and like yummy um it doesn't lose any nutrients. So the spinach is just like fresh and you don't waste spinach. So many times I would buy fresh bags of like greens to put in my smoothies and I wouldn't use it fast enough and it would go bad and wilty and disgusting. No, it's amazing. So I do that. I do about four spinach ice cubes. I do, I have a mixed blend right now. It's like mangoes, blueberries, strawberries, just frozen fruit. I do oat milk. I do a couple tablespoons of PB2, um, oat milk, PB2 and bananas. So it's super filling, it's healthy, there's no like added sugars. Mmm, mmm, mmm. It's my favorite thing in the whole world. So come along on the day with me. Hey friends, it's so much later. I actually don't remember the last time I vlogged. Um, but it's almost seven o'clock and I'm calling it a day. So I believe when we last talked, I had not gone to the grocery store. I went to the grocery store around 2, 30, 3 o'clock, did all of that, and then I worked a lot more. Maybe I did, I don't even remember. Who knows? I'll figure it out in editing. But I've I'm I've done a lot. So let's show you what's the newest development. So this room has now become box room. <laughs> um, I've got a few more boxes. This is basically all done, and this is probably clothes I'm bringing in my suitcase. Those are clothes I'm bringing in my suitcase. Everything else is done. I showed you that's all empty. I have one more load of laundry. All of these, uh, or both of these, are empty. One more box up there. This is still clothes I'm going to throw out. Boxes here. A new box there. I have to figure out where to put that Christmas tree. This is totally empty. I have to box that up. There's that. That's empty. I mean, honestly, the photos I'll probably take down this week. And then in my bedroom, I just made my bed the last time because I put new sheets on. I All I have left are just like clothes. A lot of that I'll probably still put in my suitcase. My jewelry is like pretty much all done. I'll pack up that um, lamp. My closet is pretty much done as well. I'm not sure what's most of that will probably go in a suitcase with me. Um, these are the shoes I'm packing. I have my stuff for my last load of laundry. Those are my two suitcases. I have one yoga mat. Like honestly, I mean, cleaning stuff I need to keep out. Um, but that drawer is all empty. The bathroom, I still have a lot of stuff, but I'm gonna use that all this week. Not all of that stuff, but I'll probably, this is kind of half empty. Um, but I will probably clean that out this week. So that's it, I'm feeling good. I did a lot of work today. Not quite as much as I thought I was gonna do, but actually more than I like expected myself to do, if that makes any sense. Um, so yeah. I'm going to end this vlog here as well because I feel like I've been vlogging all week. I do not know how much I've filmed, how much I'll actually keep, so I'm ending it here. I have so much fun stuff coming up, like this entire next week is going to be full of like last dinners and going to drinks with friends and having my last little memories. Um, and then Halloween is next week too, so so much to come, so stay tuned. But thank you for watching this vlog, I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys all very soon. Mwah. Bye.